All right, so this is a review on, I believe it's either a mixtape or an album, but um, it's called Upper Clapton by, oh, Upper Clapton Dream 2, yeah, by Rimsey. And um, the artwork is basically, it reminds me of my DLC, by the way, um, because he would normally in his um, uh, white vest, and man was kind of wedged still, in it? Um, but anyway, you can't really see everything. It's like, it's it's interesting. It's like he's smoking a cigar or, or spiff or whatever, but you can see the smoke, but then there's something there as well, like different images, if that makes sense. And he's looking at his phone as well. So, a man's wearing shades as well, isn't it? Get me? Like, I, I don't know, that's what I'm seeing. Like, I'm, I could be wrong, but that's what I see. So, there is 13 tracks. There is Upper Clapton, J Dan Stars featuring Snap Capone. Then there's Streets featuring the Firstborn. Then G Wagon, Sangri La. Then the, the Interlude, and there's More Money, More Problems featuring AM. Then there's Dior Money featuring Stardom. Then there's De Niro featuring Tyson. Then there's Lifestyle Cold featuring Potter Paper and Tyler Monet. Then there is another one. Then there is an Anything featuring Haley um, or Halley. How do you pronounce the name, Halley? I should know, no, because it reminds me of Halley Selassie. There you go. And then there's Rimsey. Um, well, obviously, it is Rimsey's uh, project. Um, then there's the song Abs. I'm going to butcher this. S Somalis, allow me, yeah? Absi, um, fiction M24 or M24. Um, yeah, so first of all, um, with Rimsy, yeah, one thing I've realized, I was, I was, I thought he was signed to a, a major record label, yeah, but when I saw his interview with, with Amaru Don, yeah, there's another interview there this year, he's done two this year, but the second one I was watching. And he mentioned that he's independent. Do you know what I mean? And I was like, raw. That's smart. And then when he explains certain things, I'm like, this. I'm not saying, how to put it? I'm not saying that some people are not dumb or people are not smart or whatever. But it, it took me as a surprise. So it's like, and he signed a few artists as well. And, and he knows he's lame. Like he knows, boom, he's not going to, do anything out of character just to get attention, just to get views or whatever. He does his thing, get me, and he invest, he makes money, invest, get me, and he's doing other things. So it's good to see again another another brother come out of jail, yeah, and just focus on his craft to a point where, boom, man's making money. He's good, like making legitimate money. Get me not having to do certain things, you know. Like you have to understand, like in this in this game, I don't want to call it a game, but in life. But I can actually talk about this, yeah, because there is um the song, more money, more problems, yeah, because that's what happens sometimes, right? Sometimes you feel like when you get more money, or when you don't have money, and you have to get the money, that in itself is a problem that you got to solve, right? So how do you solve that without, you know, if you've already been convicted or something, how do you solve that? Do you see what I mean? You have to get your mind right and you've got to not be around certain people that will also help influence your decision making to the point where, you see what I mean? Like, cause don't get it twisted. There's some people that come in your life where they will influence your decision making. You may think that you're a boss or that you're a leader, yeah, but sometimes... You know what I mean? Because sometimes it's just that peer pressure of, oh, if these men are on it, then I'm going to be on it too. Do you see what I mean? Like, it's the feeling of not wanting to feel left out. But at the same time, um, Rimsey was able to, like he's always said he's a leader, isn't it? So he's able to use that skill and do his thing. But um, there was something else I want to mention. But yeah, like problems in itself, right? You have to think about it, like really think, how can I solve this problem without creating other problems? Do you see what I mean? So how do you create, solve the problem of money problems without 
other certain problems coming apart because that's what happens, right? And then when you get the money, there's another set of load of problems that comes with it. So how do you solve those problems? Like that can drive someone insane. So this is why it's completely important to learn exactly how to deal with your emotions and your problems effectively to produce the desired results that you need and want without fatal consequences to self and others, whether that's going to be immediately or long term. Because sometimes that effect, yeah, where it's where you do something, may you may not see the effect immediately. You may not see it in a, in a few months' time, but you could see and feel that years later. Do you see what I mean? Why do you think some man like look? Why do you think some guys that or some rappers should I say are getting caught up yeah they do their thing and then what happens is especially in the UK drill scene from what I'm seeing is they end up getting bad they're like huh but that was for prior something that happened pr like years ago do you see what I'm saying so it catches up with you now they may not have known that information back then do you see what I mean? And they were living in the moment based on the information they had back then. Do you see what I mean? So obviously years later, they're using another sort of information to get out of that lifestyle. So it's mad. It's mad. But anyway, um, like I said, the link in the description box below which says um, become a member of the Acupedia and Trust. Get access to that course to do with healthcare so you can learn all of that information there. And yeah, I'm looking at this, this album or mixtape a 10 out of 10. I just like the realness of it. I like the fact that he's not basically, how to put it? You know when there's some artists here yeah, where you can feel they're lying. And they, like with with Rimsey here, yeah, I feel like it's, it's, it's like for me, because I used to do music, I can understand. For me, I feel like it's therapy. You see what I mean? It is fair rappy, basically. And I believe some people can resonate with what he talks about and learn from him as well. And I feel like for, it's just mad. Like I like the song with Lifestyle, I like the song with Put a Paper, Lifestyle Cold, then G Wagon. Then I do like the one with Jaden Styles, because Snap Capone, he always does his thing. Um But I don't know. Leave your answer in the comment section below. What is your favourite track on the album or the project or mixtape? Um, what's your favourite? Let me know. Um, I couldn't pick one. Um, but I am going to say this is a 10 out of 10. So big up Rimsy on this. Um, yeah, just support the brother. The link to the album is in the description box below. Hit the subscribe button. Hit the bell notification because you never know the video you suggest might just be next.